Raising chickens in Blyville is against the city's ordinance, but in the past couple of days, police have responded to more calls for these birds. Griffin Demaray has the story. But it seems here lately they have increased. Blyville police have been busy the past couple days handling calls they don't usually get. Over in a neighborhood area where eight chickens approximately were on the loose and crossing the road. Robert Hunt Angel with the Blyville Police Department said it's actually not a surprise that the number of chicken calls has increased, saying it usually starts in the spring. Tractor Supply sells them during the Easter times and people buy them from Tractor Supply and I don't think they anticipate them getting older. And then when they do and they don't have nowhere to put them, then it becomes, well, I'm not going to get rid of them because they've been a pet for this long. She says this may not seem like a big deal, but pair this with other issues in town and it can create a situation that nobody wants to happen. We do have a stray dog problem and stray dogs have been known to get in the backyards of people's homes and kill the chickens and then they're upset because the stray dogs are killing chickens that they're not supposed to have in the first place. Hot Angel said there have been people reaching out asking why this is such a big deal. And she stresses the point that they don't make the rules, they just enforce them. The city ordinance has been enacted for years. If you're going to get a pet, educate yourself on the city ordinances and know which pets you can have and which pets you can't. In Blyville, Griffin Demeray, K8 News. Griffin, thank you. Sergeant Angel stressed the city has a great relationship with the woman in the county that owns a farm, and that is where all the chickens go.